The interesting parts of our minds are, in my view, the parts that make models. The other thing is the reward function that makes the uh, mind subservient to some organism to turn some general mind into the illusion of, of being a person and caring about things. The organism needs to take a perfectly fine computational process and corrupt it with the illusion of meaning, right? So you have this reward function that needs to be protected against the axis of the mind that would want to know, why am I doing this here? And so the reward function gets wrapped into a big ball of stupid to protect it against you accessing it. As soon as you try to really look at your true incentives, it gets very boring or something else. And only when you go all the way and you just be able to look at these things, you can dissolve being a mind and you wake up. You just wake up and you look down on your hands and uh, you see, okay, I just woke up and realized I'm a mind. I'm not a monkey. I'm the side effect of the regulation needs. But does it have to be a monkey that I run on?